From documents to data to ontology, turn a time-consuming manual process into painless knowledge discovery. Automatically create ontologies from a collection of any unstructured text with Jaguar. Quickly model any knowledge domain for efficient data analytics, minimize reliance on expensive subject matter experts, and reduce ontology creation times from months to days. Jaguar builds an ontology by identifying concepts from a document. An ontology is a way to represent the knowledge of your domain, and an easy way to build one is to extract important words from documents representing your organization's corpus. To initiate the concept search, we provide the system seed concepts. Just think of a few important words in your domain. Jaguar then scans the document for your seed concepts and finds more concepts that are related to them. Jaguar then establishes semantic relationships between those concepts. Input documents can be reports, audits, web pages, emails, tweets, social media content, user manuals, etc. Alternatively, you can let Jaguar loose on your documents to see the big picture of your domain. Then, you can select the concepts of interest for your seed set. The resulting ontology can be reviewed and edited in our accompanying ontology editor. You can alternatively use an ontology editor of your choice. In a hierarchical representation, our Jaguar editor makes it easy to review, browse, and edit the concepts and relationships for added precision. It also provides insight into the source phrases and sentences that generated the connections. Here's Jaguar, Limba's ontology builder. Today we'll show you how you can expand an initial set of C concepts to build an ontology by looking through a document of your choice. In this example, we'll build out an ontology related to assets. I've already loaded a couple files into the system. Here we see a text document related to assets that we pulled from Wikipedia. Text like this is useful because it has a lot of information in it that we're going to want to pull for our concepts. As we can see, there's definitions and lots of concepts that we can use, like goodwill, copyrights, trademarks. All of this is listed under intangible assets. We have other assets listed below. So this is a good document to use if we wanted to build an ontology based on assets. So to inform Jaguar on which words are concepts, we also need to give it a seed file. A seed file can simply be a list of words or something that looks like this. Or here, we'll be looking for product, equity, liability, and things like that to bootstrap the system. So once we have our data in the system, select our seed ontology and the data. We can then click on the job to see when it's finished. To start looking at the relations that were established, we'll choose one here. Click on our concepts. Because we're looking at assets, let's click on that. And we can see we found a bunch of different asset types. And you can click on it to learn more about how this concept was established and where it was found. Hopefully you now have a better understanding of Jaguar and how it can be leveraged by your company. Thanks for watching from Limba. Please reach out to us with any questions or for help on your next project. To receive a free consultation, email us at info at where we can customize a demo to suit your needs about your specific situation.